I have an exciting announcement to make. My rebranding, relaunching of the dreamtranslator.com will be live. Actually, it's live now if you want to go over and take a peek. <laughs> and one of the most exciting things about that, the most exciting thing is that I am now, as part of that rebranding, I felt called to make it bigger, huge. Something that was bigger than me and my ego and bigger than my protests of I don't know how or I can't. And those are the Dream Circle memberships. For over two years, I have been facilitating a dream group chat that I started up. I feel as though I have a very unique framework because over those two years, I have continually refined the rules, the framework to make an asynchronous, ongoing, small group, dream work, chat work and work really, really well. I'm gonna keep the groups small because I feel that when you stay small, that fosters a sense of safety and vulnerability and trust. When you get too big, it's just, it's not at, there's not that same intimacy. And I'm having the membership start what I, at what I feel is ridiculously accessible. And I know that's easy for someone to say <laughs> when it's their offering, right? My husband jokes that whenever you put a price tag on something, you, you just have to include the word only right in front of it. It's only $9.99. And then of course it's only that. So of course it must be affordable, right? But no, I think it's very accessible if dream work is something that like lights you up and the whole thing idea of delving into your dreams and figuring out what the symbols are trying to convey to you, if that excites you, then I feel that $10 a month will be a worthwhile investment. I want to keep it really accessible, at least starting out. Um, you know, so if you come in now, you get the founding members price of $10 a month, which will not change. And yeah, I'm super excited. So feel free to go over to www.thedreamtranslator.com. I joined the wait list for the Dream Circle. Fill out all the information. And then by the time October 5th comes around, when the doors swing open, I will have the small groups ready. And this is not going to be solely targeting those in the spiritual space. My vision for this was to be even so much bigger than that. I feel like we're all spiritual beings. And so regardless of how someone identifies with their religious um, affiliations, I want them to feel comfortable. I want them to feel safe to share. So there is a field there where it asks for religious affiliation. So that way I can try and group people of similar belief systems together because I feel like the, the gift there in dream work, it transcends all of that. But I know if someone who does not believe in one particular religious system, if they hear the words phrased in such a way that puts them off, then they're not gonna be as receptive, right? And so if I feel as though dream work, dream symbolism, the gold is there for everybody regardless, then I want people to not be put off. I want to meet them where they are and, and have a space that feels good to them. So that is what I have going on. The dreamtranslator.com. Even if you don't want to sign up for the membership, uh, feel free to check it out. 
Let me know if you have any suggestions about what I could change to make it more visually appealing or seem professional because it is a, a one woman show over here as of yet. Um, I do have a team page on there and there's me in a little bio, but I am so eager for this thing to evolve and grow and vet other dream interpretators dream work facilitators to come on board and um and help as this thing evolves into something so much bigger than just me it's a new chapter really for so long i have been jumping from one thing to another and i will continue to probably do that because i just find so many things like dazzling <laughs> you know that that glitter and so I will probably always be exploring new modalities new this new that but I felt strangely inexplicably inexplicably called to revisit this and like just blow it out of the park and I asked myself okay if I'm going to treat this as a legit Oh, there's Q Joe. <laughs> uh, if I'm going to treat this as a legitimate business, would a legitimate business, when you go to that domain, would it have you redirected to a page on another website, myaprilific.com website? No, it would not. So I feel like this thing, this, this vision is so grand that it really deserves its own everything, its own email its own domain its own website with multiple pages its own uh, i think i already said this email but like at the dream translator.com you know i reinvested i reimagined i've made the thing so much bigger with these memberships in addition to the dream interpretation services and podcasts i was already offering so again i am super excited check out the website. I am really hopeful that this whole idea of delving into your dreams like intrigues you and that you sign up because there's no commitment. I'm not making you sign up for a year. It's $10 a month. And one of the big things in there is I have under my frequently asked questions, do I have to remember my dreams to get use out of joining a dream circle? And the answer is absolutely not. One of the clarifying questions I have when you sign up is I ask you how frequently do you recall your dreams? And so if someone says always, I don't wanna put all the people with always in one group and then the people with never in another group, right? So I'm gonna have people who always or frequently remember their dreams in groups with those who like never or rarely and the benefit is there over the past two years of having been in a dream circle myself i have heard from a lot of the people who, who don't recall their dreams they feel um they've they've told me that they feel a little bit guilty for not um, being able to add to the conversation very much because they don't recall their dreams and then secondly like when someone does talk about their dream nothing's clicking for them they don't really know what to say because it's just not coming to them but they have expressed in the same breath so much gratitude for having been in that space because it feels like a gift to them this dream work once you sign up, I'll have it all the framework listed out as to how everything's going to go, because there is a certain amount of structure that's needed for these chat groups to go well. You know, we don't want to be working on three dreams at once, two dreams at once. Uh, we don't want to give a dream too much time. Uh, we don't want to give it too little. I have addressed all of those things. And that's not to say that there won't be more things to come up that I can further tweak, but I feel like I have a pretty darn good system in place. So again, I feel like this is for everybody, regardless of your religious affiliation, regardless of whether you recall your dreams or not, there is a lot of value, I feel, to be had in dream work. So I hope you will join me, thedreamtranslator.com.
All right. Bye for now.